There are several basic rules for compiling a workout program to get shredded and reduce body fat. In this video, I'll explain the four main rules to maximize fat burning. So watch the video till the end. It'll be interesting. Let's go. The first rule, workout volume and number of repetitions. Imagine that you bench press 80 kilograms for six reps. In this case, the total weight of the set will be 480 kilograms. Now imagine that you bench press 50 kilograms for 15 reps. In this case, the total weight of the set will be 750 kilograms, which is more than in the first case. In other words, moderately high rep workouts will help you burn more calories than low rep workouts. But following this logic, you can perform exercises only with your own weight, increasing the total weight to the maximum due to the number of repetitions. But this is not entirely true. The fact is that we can achieve the maximum hormonal release for fat burning with minimal muscle acidification, which significantly destroys them by performing the exercise in the time range of 24 seconds, after which failure should occur. Therefore, the maximum reps that we can use is 15 to 20 or more, depending on the amplitude of the movement. For example, doing full range barbell squats at a moderate pace, it can be 10 repetitions. And when doing bodyweight squats at home at a faster pace and a reduced amplitude, it'll be at least 15 to 20 times. The second rule, do basic exercises. Performing complex basic exercises, the leaders of which are squats, bench press and deadlift, the maximum number of muscle groups are included in the work, which leads to a large hormonal release and makes us spend more calories. For example, the load on the legs in the leg machine won't be comparable to the load in squats, and squats will always be a more effective exercise. The third rule, the cardio workout. The more you move while getting shredded, the faster you will achieve your goal. An excellent addition to the main strength training will be cardio. Cardio can be added after the main strength training for 20 to 30 minutes, or on separate days for 60 to 90 minutes, depending on your fitness and cardio intensity. The intensity of cardio can be medium or high, for example running, or light, for example walking. The fourth rule, nutrition. No matter how intensely you train, you won't get shredded without adjusting your diet. The easiest way to reduce calories is to replace some of the carbohydrate foods with protein. For example, instead of potatoes and meatballs, try to eat fish and vegetables. One gram of protein and one gram of carbohydrates have the same calorie content, four calories. But the average content of carbohydrates in 100 grams of carbohydrate foods is 60, and protein foods is only 15. That is, protein foods will always have a lower calorie content. Thus, by replacing part of the carbohydrate foods with protein in your daily diet, you'll already start to reduce body fat and get shredded. The best protein foods for getting shredded are squid, chicken breast, and lean meats such as beef. The best vegetables are cucumbers or any kind of cabbage. And the best cereals are rice or other dark colored cereals. By the way, friends, be sure to watch the video about the main mistakes in apps workout. Link is on the screen right now. And also write in the comments, what is your body fat percentage? Share, it'll be interesting to read. If you like this video, push the like button and subscribe to my channel. See you soon.